Whoa, okay. Initiating. Hello there, I'm Chris and this video is going to be some sort of experiment. Is it possible to craft a baseball bat from a tree? Well, from a freshly cut tree. Let's find out. This is gonna end so fucking bad. Back at my workshop and what I have here is an improvised ternary contraption. Got a few chisels for the job, but after a first test I found out that preparation is key. So first of all I will remove all the branches and the bark. And this is pretty easy to do while the wood is still wet. So let's do this. You see? Very easy. Ah. <laughs> And after quite a bit of sanding, that's the result turned out pretty good. It is considerably wet. And what I also noticed at my first test, I turned this section and after that I hit the ground as hard as I could and it pretty much cracked from the thinnest point upwards. Maybe this harsh edge caused it to crack, so I will definitely smooth out the edges. I guess I will find out. Let's turn this baby. Oh my god. <laughs> hmm. Oh shit. Oh shit. This is going to take some time. <laughs> Okay, never mind. Holy sh Wait a sec. <laughs> Yo, the cut is so deep. Oh my god. I just had another idea involving the circular saw again, so yeah. Okay. Oh my god. Why not use the chisel? Why am I so fing stupid? Nice, I'm getting there. I just had another ingenious idea. I would try to mark it to find, you know, the spots where I have to remove more material. Well, yeah, I just chiseled away so much material and it's slowly starting to take shape. And now I am 100% sure that the circular saw experiment really fucked up this project because check this out, this is so deep. Okay. Oh no. After quite a few sessions of marking and chiseling away the material, I am now finally able to bump up the speed a little bit and finally start to turn this thing. Oh my god, this is amazing. Whoa. That's another valid technique to mark the spots where you have to take away the material. Just go as deep as it would, you know. Oh sh There we go. That seems to be the best technique for marking it. Yeah. Back to the gym. Check it out. I need to take it away. Right there. And right there. And, and yeah. Let's do this. Check this out. I have to say that I am a little bit surprised since it worked out so good, but it will probably warp as it dries, maybe even crack, but I'm not sure if I'm going to find out because in the next video I will go for a Lucille makeover, you know, wrap it with barbed wire and I will go for a destruction test as well. And to summarize, yes, it is possible to craft a baseball bat 
from a freshly cut tree and moreover it is actually pretty convenient since the dust does not get airborne it already dried a little bit but that's the dust that's that's crazy this is convenient wet is always a good thing right <laughs> if you enjoyed this video you'll know what to do right hit that like button right now leave a comment or question below because i love answering them and subscribe for the viral vibe oh yeah